Interesting. Uh, do I have video? Oh, there it is. We're back. Okay. So let's get this set up. I got to stop soon anyway, but we're going to definitely get this industry set up and get at least one set of dyed hemp shirt, I guess. We're going to make some drug rugs. That's what we're going to make. All right. So in this, we're going to not do hemp thread. Okay. Instead, what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to split this up. We're going to split this up. by putting the thread here, having it give to the workshop. No, 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 we're not gonna do that. We're gonna have the thread be on both sides. And we're gonna put the dyed thread in the middle and that'll have bins. Mm, there we go, all right. And then we're gonna do pile. And the way we're gonna organize it, this is the logic that's gonna work for this. You can do anything, almost, in Dwarf Fortress if you just work with it. So, no, it's not plants. It's gonna be under cloth. So then we're gonna do thread here. This is just hemp thread, just like the other one. But the reason this is gonna hold our dyed thread and not our other threads, so this is the regular thread, right? Yep, is because this it's going to take from the dyer's workshop. It won't receive hemp thread from anywhere else. This is going to give to the dyer's workshop. Oh, whoops, I, sh I should do, I need the dye. I need the freaking dye itself. All right, so get rid of this pile. Um, food. Uh, milled plants. dies we'll go here okay so no barrels here give to that oh you're already giving to that okay um, and then give to the workshop all right and then this takes from the workshop so you basically just have a pretty simple system it's it's thread here, dye here, they both give to, and then they poop out some dyed thread. We're going we're gonna to allow bins there, but we will not allow any bins here or barrels here. Because I want to see how much I have. And then this here, cloth goods, well that doesn't have any of any of those things. Alright, good. Now they're putting that, they put that one in the, what the hell? No, 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 you can't put that there. Oh, I forgot to set it to take from links only. Son of a, oh boy, oh boy. Oh man, all right, well. Oh, this is giving to that. Stockpile number 93, is that you? Let's name it. That's not a stockpile number 94. Dyed hemp thread. Hemp thread and dyes. Okay, so what is this giving to now? This is giving to hemp thread. That's good. That's correct. Okay. So they should stop putting hemp in there. Okay, and now this, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a uh, dye thread. Oh, you could dye cloth, too. Oh, I could dye all the existing hemp cloth. Cool. Um, quantity, zero. No, I want a quantity of, say, five. Six. Um... And the quantity of six 
to dye threads every single day as long as, uh, no, it doesn't even matter how much there are. Delete all of these. As long as I have six thread, oops, and six dye. Um, and then I'm actually gonna expand this since I now know that you can use cloth. You can dye cloth as cloth, hemp cloth. All right, so then we're gonna go in here and we're gonna go here again and I'm gonna do um, dye, make new order, dye cloth. That's gonna be again six, assuming that every single day, assuming that um, there is six of each item available. Which there should be. Aha! Tossed Nanuber, the gem cutter, has created a Nazomumam. Aral Likat, a perfect rock crystal. He claims it is a family heirloom. Could I could I put that? Could I decorate something with that? This is a perfect rock crystal. It menaces with spikes of rock crystal. Neat. Wow, you know, the, the most creative jeweler I've ever met. Uh, we need to, we need to freaking do something with some of these gems, man. We got, let's cut all those amethysts and the chryso barrels too. Add new, cut. Amethyst and Crystal Birth. I'm over the hell you pronounce that. Let's do that, yeah. Hmm. Oh, oh, let's not forget about this. Holy crap, almost forgot about this. Uh, they're suspending the construction of that for some reason. That's interesting. Is this more caverns? Okay, so that's... We're still not to the end of it. Okay, take care of that real quick. And I think I'm not gonna collect any webs. I, I'm gonna smooth this though. Why isn't this smooth, you know? I don't know what's going on with this. This is just my mind. I, I should do something with this level. It looks like uh, one of the squads has begun training. Month must have just turned over. No. Yeah, it's first. It's first of timber. Okay. There's my honey, my wax goods. Honeybee wax honeycomb. Honeybee wax cake. Whoa, honeycomb shouldn't be stored here. That's for pressing. Oh no. Tools. I believe honeycomb. Yeah, that's it. Oh no, so I can't even do that. Oh man. This is the one problem with the stockpile screen. It's the tools. Why? So a, a honeycomb is a wax finished good. 
I guess I could disable tools. A honeycomb that's not pressed is a waxed finished good, just like all of the goods you make out of it after pressing it. That it's it's redundant. Why are my why are my decorated what? Why are you not wearing these guys? This is a well-crafted horse bone left gauntlet. On the item is an image of Almosh Glittermost, the deity of the sun, fire, volcanoes, and mountains, depicted as a female great horned owl, and two dwarves in donkey bone by Bomrek Zunthes. The two dwarves are prostrated, prostrating themselves before Almosh Glittermost. Yeah, that's really cool. Who was, why are we not wearing our bone armor, boners? I mean, I know why you're not wearing the helmets. Because we need to... We need to decorate the helmets with horns. But why aren't you waiting... Why aren't you wearing the other stuff? Military. Boners. What is going on? Okay. I should write that one down too. I should write that one down. Uh, let's see. Un unpressed wax. Honeycombs. Okay, and then, uh, unable to specify bone as a material. Military uniforms. There it is. Boosh. Le Boosh. Okay. Shia Le Boosh. Oh, this guy's carrying a bin. Where are you taking it? Let's find out. You there! Oh, perfect. Look at you go. What? Where did you put that bin? Interesting choice to carry that bin here and just cause it to vanish, I guess. Oh, it's under the sphalerite. Okay, so dying has commenced. Now, let's go to the Colothiris shop here. So we have our hemp industry set up including dyeing them, dyeing the hemp. Let's add a new task, and let's make the finest robe you've ever seen. Or should I make a cloak? What's more hippie? What's more like, what's more stoner, dude? I don't know, I don't smoke weed. Help me out here, guys. Like, is it a robe? Or is it a cloak? Could be a cap. I don't, I mean a hood. A hood. I mean, yeah. A hoodie, you know? But let's go ahead and, uh, you know, let's do a tunic. I think, honestly, I think it might be tunic. Uh, whoops. Specify cloth. Hemp. Why do I have 990,000 hemp cloth? That doesn't seem right. Oh, crap. I couldn't see. Hold on. I can't see chat right now because I, I screwed up. Because of the screen restart? How about chat? Okay. I was reading old chat. I was reading old chat. I was like, why are these guys so quiet? Um, yeah, tunic. I mean, it's a shirt, but it's like a longer shirt, right? Uh, cloak. Okay, we're going to do we're going to do cloak. We're, you're, you're right. I'm not qualified to make this decision. <laughs> uh, so cloth and we're going to do hemp. Uh, but the thing about the cloth, we're gonna we're gonna make this work. So this is where my cloth normally is, and I'm removing hemp from it. 
And then I'm gonna make a new stockpile. This is my hemp thread, my dyed hemp thread. Uh, oh crap, I need to like, I need to make another hemp cloth stockpile that takes from the dyer's crap. <laughs> I, okay, no, no, no. First, okay, so what do I have right now? I have the hemp is getting spun into thread here. Then it's being taken down here. I'm gonna put in the hemp thread stockpile that gives specifically to the dyer's workshop. It gets dyed, it gets put here. From there, I need to make a new cloth stockpile that's only for hemp. And I guess I'll put it back up here. This might all get erased because this is my tutorial fortress for my videos, but um, let's. Let's go ahead and make this part of the stockpile right here just for hemp cloth, but not any hemp cloth. Specifically, you can use bins specifically hemp cloth that comes out of the dyer's workshop or crap they will spin the hemp cloth isn't gonna come out of the dyer's workshop how do you dye one material not the others and use all of it i would have to make two separate industries i think one to do all the non-dyed stuff, and one to do the dyed stuff. No, it's possible. It's possible. We eliminate hemp from this stockpile. We did that already, right? Yes, there's no hemp in that stockpile. All of the hemp that comes through here will indeed be dyed. So this will work. Okay, and takes from links only. This is gonna work, I think. So spinning thread is completed. That's that's right, okay. And what do we have here? We've got cloth bin, what's in that? Uh, a bunch of spider silk, silk, llama wool. A bunch of hemp, cloth. Oh, okay, so this is a cloth, bin, uh, a cloth stockpile. I just need to make this cloth. And then uh, I want to give to this. And then I need to rename this as hemp thread slash cloth. Okay, so my dwarf should take, um, and since, it, okay, so my dwarf should take the cloth down there now that's already been uh, weaved, woven. It's already been woven. And my dyer, because my dyer is working with um, a manager controlled work orders, shall alternate between dyeing the cloth and dyeing the thread. So we should get dyed cloth pretty soon. Um, in fact, some thread just got brought up here. And this here for dyers, this needs to give to this as well. Right, yes. Give to the loom, okay. I wish I had cleaned this out of stones and stuff before. I could clear this out of um, all this misplaced stuff right now. Let's do that. All I do is dump it all, like so. I'll dump the sphalerite too. Let's just clean that out. Oh God, who dare message me? No more of that. I'm a professional, guys. <laughs> okay, stop now. Um, and go into my stocks screen. Then I go to cloth. No, I go to thread. Well, cloth, thread is in cloth, right? No, not in this screen. In this screen, thread is in thread. And I undump all of these and they'll drop them. Look at that. 
and they'll put them back where they're supposed to go now. Oh, but I, I still need to do that for these two. There we go. Oh, and I need to dump that, or undump that ore. Stone. Stones, undump this ore, please. Okay. It's perfectly good sphalerite. You there. I won't go to the stocks menu this time because I'm pretty, I'm just right here. There's only two. Go to the hemp thread, undump, okay. And you, well wait, don't drop it right there. There, drop it there. Okay, hemp thread, undump. Okay, so they moved them all out of the central stockpile so I can see what's going on better. Bruh, bruh. Oh God, I answered it. Bro, hold on a second. <laughs> oh man, I do not have a lot of time left, but that's okay. We're gonna do this. We're gonna get a shirt. Here, uh. I'm gonna, oh man, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say 15. 15 minutes, we got 15 minutes. That's it, okay, let's do this shit. No pausing. There's gonna be, there's always pausing. Anyway, look, okay, so he's got a bin there. Maybe he's taking that bin up here. Does that bin contain wonderful dyed hemp cloth? Zinc bin, what do you contain? No, you don't contain shit. There's hemp cloth, okay, and it's dyed, is it not? No, I don't want, yes, there. Oh, it's midnight blue, yes! All right, we got dyed hemp cloth. Okay, so Clothier's Workshop. Make me, I wanna get a notification. I need the notification. I think we already made that cloak, but let's just do it this way. A cloak, it needs to be made out of hemp. Okay, here we go. Come on, come on guys, you could do it. Dye the thread, weave it into cloth, and make me a drug rug. There he goes, there he goes. Yes, the hemp cloak has been completed. But now who dons the cloak? This is the completion of a hemp industry, a dyed hemp industry. <laughs> Sorry, I'm probably offending people who smoke. I don't know which of these terms are like offensive. Uh, I don't know, man. Sorry if I'm making fun of people. I don't have any strong opinions on marijuana. You know, I don't really, I don't even think about it. Uh, what am I, what am I looking for? Stocks, there we go. Armor, because it's armor for some reason. Uh, cloak, cloaks, coats, 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 coats and cloaks, coats and cloaks, here we go. Um, hemp, hemp, so many cloaks. There it is, hemp cloaks. Oh, I, I guess the first one got completed too. Um, mode. Masterwork? All right, well, what's this one? Can I like view? Okay, description. This was not, the masterwork one was not dyed. This is the only one that's dyed, okay. Zuglar Udizkadol, the carpenter. Um, let's make sure he's wearing it. He's got two hemp socks and a hemp cloak on. And that hemp cloak is quite valuable, in fact. I wonder how much it would sell for. That hemp cloak was dyed and it's made of hemp. Well, that's good. That's good. 
good to know I'm not being an asshole here, you know? Usually I'm accidentally an asshole. So he's got a tunic and a cloak on. A sheep wool tunic. Two hemp socks and a hemp cloak. That's amazing. Uh, congratulations, Zuglar Udizkadol, the first of many to wear one of our new lines of blue, dimple cup, midnight blue hemp cloaks. Um, does it tell me the value of it? The basic value, okay, so 360 dwarf bucks for that cloak. Pretty nice, I'd say. Pretty nice. All right, and with the conclusion of our hemp industry, as well as a couple uh, other adventures, I have some things I need to do, namely uh, trucking around in Euro Truck Simulator because uh, this last week has been very busy and I'm eager to do nothing for several hours at a time. Uh, so until next time, I will probably work on a video and release a video rather than a stream, but I should say for a moment here, I should just take one moment to first um, just mention one more time the music by Sigil and Stone, or of the album Sigil and Stone by Supera Concilio. Really great music. You can find them at Bandcamp. And also, don't forget to check out um, the streaming of uh, Singe Metal, which has unfortunately been pushed back a week because of life circumstances and usually suffers from time zone issues as well. But Singe Metal is being done with um, Roland from Dwarf Fortress Roundtable. Uh, so I'll be streaming that hopefully next week, but life stuff, you never know when it's going to settle out. So we'll see what happens with that. Uh, but thank you guys for joining me on my 420 Blaze It subscriber special.